In 2019, our world was hit with a pandemic unlike no other. But today, I'm here to talk about a different type of epidemic that is plaguing our country. And that is literacy. Twenty percent of our adults cannot read at all. Moreover, fifty percent are not reading at a third grade level. It is on us, as U.S. citizens, to help one another. But first, we're going to check in with one of our citizens that was having trouble reading and hear his testimony. So, not knowing how to read really put me in a bad situation with my wife. Well, now my ex-wife. See, she changed the words in my divorce contract. She took everything from me, bro. So, I mean, she took the house, man. She took my truck, my cat, my dog, and my lawyer. I'm hurt. I really loved you, man. She took, like, hundreds of dollars from me. You see, these testimonies are real. America, we do have problems. But our foundation is here to help. Now, with the Brandon McKell, Robert Iron, Pedro Rambis Foundation for Literacy, we have some sponsors that we believe you would like to hear from. My name is LeBron James and I play for the LA Lakers. I'm number six. Today I'm here with ESPN and the Brandon McKell, Robert Iron, Pedro Rambis Literacy Foundation. And we're bringing awareness to something that's dear to my heart. Uh, more than 43 million Americans uh, read under a third grade level or can't do basic math. I'm here to try to help these people, these U.S. citizens, achieve greatness by helping them pursue their educational endeavors. Thank you, LeBron. I am Barack Obama, your 44th president. I'm here with 60 Minutes and Brandon McKell, Robert Iron Pedro Rambis Foundation for Literacy. Uh, learning is the foundation of the human experience. It begins at birth and never stops. It is a continuous and malleable link across all stages of the human development. Disparities in learning across the outcomes around the world have deep consequences for social income, mobility, health, and well-being. Thank you, Barack. America, one thing you can do is donate to our cause by visiting www.brandonmckellrobertironpedrorambisfoundationforliteracy.org.